This lesson is the second of two that show how to solve rational equations. For the first example, simplify the equation by multiplying each term by x, which is the LCD of all terms of the equation. In the first term, x times x is x squared. In the second term, the factors of x cancel, leaving 12. In the third term, x times 1 is x. Then subtract x from both sides, and subtract 12 from both sides. The result is the polynomial equation x squared minus x minus 12 equal to 0. Then factor the left side of the equation for the solutions x equal 4 and x equal negative 3. Next, check the solution x equal 4. Substitute x equal 4 in the equation. 12 divided by 4 is 3. And since 3 plus 1 is 4, the solution checks. Then check the solution x equal negative 3. Substitute x equal negative 3 in the equation. 12 divided by negative 3 is negative 4. And since negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3, the solution checks. So the equation has two solutions, x equal 4 and x equal negative 3. And they both check. For the second equation, simplify by multiplying each term by the LCD, which is x times x plus 1. In the first term, the factors of x cancel, leaving x plus 1 times 4. In the second term, the factors of x plus 1 cancel, leaving negative x times 3. The last term, is just x times x plus 1. Then simplify. In the first term, x plus 1 times 4 is 4x plus 4. In the second term, negative x times 3 is minus 3x. And in the last term, x times x plus 1 is x squared plus x. Then continue to simplify the equation. Combine 4x and negative 3x into x. Then flip the equation around and subtract x from both sides. The terms of x cancel out, leaving x squared equals 4. Then subtract 4 from both sides, and the equation is x squared minus 4 equals 0. To solve this polynomial equation, factor the left side of the equation, and the solutions are x equal negative 2 and x equal positive 2. Then check the solutions. Substitute x equal negative 2 in the equation. 4 divided by negative 2 is negative 2, and negative 2 plus 1 is negative 1. Then negative 3 divided by negative 1 is 3. And since 3 minus 2 is equal to 1, the solution checks. Then check x equal plus 2. Substitute x equal 2 in the equation. 4 divided by 2 is 2. And 2 plus 1 is 3. Then 3 divided by 3 is 1, and since 2 minus 1 is equal to 1, the solution checks.
So the equation has two solutions, x equal negative 2 and x equal positive 2. And they both check. This lesson was the second of two that show how to solve rational equations. And this lesson was brought to you by the Math Fun Academy. It's continuing mission to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new math and new equations, to boldly go where no math student has gone before.